What's up Guns N' Roses fans? We got two pieces of news today. So one is regarding Axl Rose's ex-wife who's apparently pissed at Axl Rose's ex-girlfriend Stephanie Seymour. So Harry Brandt, who's Stephanie Seymour's son, uh, basically went on Instagram and basically tweet, wrote what you see here. He basically said, you got hit by a truck and the license plate said Seymour. Happy birthday to the woman that inspired me since 1996. I love you, mom. And you guys are probably wondering, well, what's the big deal about that? Uh, apparently, he's quoting Axel Rose. Rose reportedly once told his uh, his assistant that he'd been hit by a Mack truck and the license plate said Seymour. He was referring to his girlfriend at that time, Stephanie Seymour, who he was dating back during the early 90s. And then Rose's ex-wife, Erin Everly, who was in the Sweet Child of Mine video, posted to Brant's Instagram post. This was brought to my attention, as I could say a lot about this, but I'll just say it's unnecessary and cruel. One day I will tell my truth. And she reportedly wrote another comment too, hashtag like mother, like son. And it's kind of weird because, you know, uh, Stephanie Seymour sued Axl Rose back in 1994 and Aaron Everly who actually testified against Rose at the same trial. So it seems like maybe Axel and Aaron have like, you know, maybe they've sorted out their issues and they're friendly on friendly terms. And we also know that Aaron Everly's friends with Slash and friends with Slash's girlfriend as well. Um, and she's also been spotted at some Guns N' Roses concerts as well. I find this all very interesting. Uh, going up in a story reported about earlier this week, uh, Slash almost joined the band Stone Roses, but apparently he was not able to join because he wore leather pants. Uh, this was according to a story told by Aziz Ibrahim, who was the former Stone Roses guitarist. He revealed during a podcast interview, and apparently this happened around the time Slash left Guns N' Roses just after October of 1996. Slash was in England, and apparently Stone Roses had just parted ways with their guitarist, John Squire. And uh, there had been auditions and Slash had offered to play with Stone Roses. And there was a lot of bitterness between Stone Roses members and John Squire. And they really wanted to piss off John. So they thought, let's get the greatest rock icon of all time. But then they thought, you know what? We're not going to work with a guy who has leather pants. So apparently that's the reason Slash never joined the band. Although these rumors surfaced back in 2010, Slash was actually asked about the rumors. He told the Guardian newspaper, I'd heard of Stone Roses, but I've never met them. I think I was probably too busy in Guns N' Roses at the time. Maybe it might have been a good idea. Someone told me we tried to recruit the lead singer into Velvet Revolver. That's not true either. So if you guys want to actually check out uh, the podcast, the link is down below. And let me know your thoughts as always. Comment down below and make sure you guys subscribe for the latest Guns N' Roses news. Take care.